All right, guys, happy Monday. Coach Justin with you. Uh, just some few administrative things we want to talk about. If you haven't noticed already, we've got some pretty awesome swag that just hit the shelf, so make sure you pick up your uh, tanks or your purple or your black uh, shirt. So hope you guys enjoy them. They are limited time, so get yourselves a shirt or a tank. So let's talk about what we've got going on today. Strength piece, we've got a shoulder press, five by two. We want to think about these reps and we want to go heavy after each of those rounds. So maybe warm up with the bar a little bit, throw a little weight, then I want you guys to start getting heavy, okay? A couple things to think about. Keep that midline nice and tight, keep those legs nice and straight, and then we want to keep that bar path nice and straight, We're not doing the overarching, okay? We don't want to have that full back extension overarching our backs, okay? Keep that midline nice and tight, bar path going up and straight, down and up. So that's our strength piece today. When we're done with that, then we've got to go ahead. We're going to go into our uh, Metcon, which is going to be. Oh look, Greg just finished a mile, which is two laps in the big circle up the hill. So once we get done with that, we're going to immediately go into back squats. This is going to be kind of medium weights for you guys. So we're going to be doing 225 for the guys and 155 for the ladies. Greg's finishing up 30. So that's right, we've got 30 of these bags. 28, 29, 30. He's gonna go back out in one, one more mile. So the Metcon today, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, is going to be one mile, followed by 30 back squats, 225, 155, and then we're gonna finish it up with that mile. A couple things to consider. Uh, if this weight is gonna be too heavy for you guys, Maybe think about dropping it back a little bit to maybe do about 70% uh, of what your one rep max is. Maybe three uh, sets of 10. Maybe that's something that we can look into. Um, yeah, so if you have any questions, uh, let me know. And I know I've been rambling and on, but I want to give an opportunity to uh, do a little viewer mail here. So uh, I hope you guys want to see what we're doing with our back. Um, go ahead and answer Jimmy's question, which is why does his lower back hurt? Uh, when he's doing some uh, squats. So uh, we'll go ahead and talk about that. We'll pass the baton off to Coach Greg here. Hey guys. So yeah, midline stabilization, part of a squat. Why does your back start to hurt? Front squatting, uh, kind of more so than a back squat, is gonna cause that weight to be slightly in front of you. So it's going to make put a little more stress on the midline. So you start doing squats, and if your ability is not perfect, you know you're struggling with positioning. It's going to cause you to get a little bit of flexion if you're not really bracing through the stomach. So what we see is you go to the bottom of that squat and get relaxed. Oh, and I get this little rounded back position. Now as I come up, I recorrect that, but it's a lot of movement there, which is over time going to cause me to be. Uh, a little bit in pain. So the way I want to correct that is I want to actively brace against that stomach. Thinking about it from rep one all the way through rep 30, uh, this workout, to, uh, to kind of mitigate that. And uh, to me, that's the biggest area you want to think about is your, your midline. It's going to be the, the transfer station. It's where we're going to create a lot of that. Um, so for me, it's midline stabilization. Any other, any other thoughts on that, Justin? I think uh, where the bar is at in relation to uh, where you're in the middle of your foot is. Uh, you want that bar is getting too far forward, that's going to smoke your back. You want to try to get that torso nice and tall to where that bar pack is really just kind of cutting you in half and uh, kind of keep the ends of the bars in the middle of your feet. Think of it kind of an invisible line, so to speak. And I'll save your back a little bit and try to keep that torso nice and tall. So, Jimmy, great question. Um, you make it hot, you make workouts hot, so appreciate the effort you do. So thanks for the question. If you have any more comments or questions or anything else, just leave them on the uh, Facebook or leave them on the YouTubes, but uh, like us on the Facebooks, on the Instagrams, on the YouTube, subscribe to that, and uh, hope you guys enjoyed this. So thanks guys, rock Take on. Care. Bye.